Hey guys, we are in Atlantic City today, New Jersey, and it's because a new Panic escape room just opened. Um, it's actually quite big. They have uh, numerous games in there. Shall we check them out? So you can either park in the Caesar um, Casino parking, or you can park at, there's actually another one right there with the self parking for $5, which is cheaper than the Caesar one. Um, Remember to like and subscribe for new content. What's good everybody, it is Brandon from Escape the Rumors. We are in Atlantic City, New Jersey at one of Panic Room's newest locations. And we're gonna play two games here because the other two we already played. But before we do so, we're gonna get into it. We're gonna learn more about this location and the general manager, Elvin. Elvin, how are you? I'm doing well, I'm doing well, thank you much. All right, well thanks for having us. Yes. Uh, we're actually standing inside Atlantis Rising, which we have played at their Boston location. Uh, make sure you check out our website for our review on that. And also we're giving you some peek of more inside this room as well at that location. Uh, but the first thing I want to ask you is, I kind of already gave it away, how many rooms do you have available here at this location? So currently we have four rooms. Okay. Um, that would be our Atlantis Rising, Zombie Outbreak, Medieval Madness, and our Cartel Crackdown. Wow, and we're playing Medieval Madness and? Our Zombie Outbreak. Zombie Outbreak. No live actors, so <laughs> you know, if you're afraid of uh, anyone getting in your face or, yeah. you know. But <laughs> not there at are, the moment. They're jump scares, though, right? Or some? Um, not really, but um, don't want to give away too much. Okay. <laughs> Just be on survival mode. Yes, <laughs> definitely. <laughs> So we've actually had our grand opening about two weeks ago. Oh, wow. Um, so the location has been doing well. Um, I think Atlantic City needed something fun for friends and family to come and do, yeah. um, but uh, we're excited to be here. Okay. Um, I know it's only been two weeks, but we yeah. usually ask this question anyways, mm -hmm. and it's kind of cool to hear what you have to say. Yeah. Which seems to be the most popular room that people are booking? Oh, hands down, that'd be our Atlantis room. Atlantis. Uh, everybody loves the mythology of Atlantis, so, uh, and as you see, the set that we have is, is grand. Yeah, this set design is amazing. We're only giving you this side of the wall, but it is, yeah, come check it out for yourself. <laughs> um, the next thing we wanna know is, um, so far since you've opened, have you had a chance to game master and see players in the room? Of stuff? course, yeah. So um, we've been open only two weeks, but we have have run uh, over 70 games already. Wow. Um, so we're, as, as I said, we're mentioned, we're um, friends and families, uh, people are having a blast here. Um, but yeah, um, we've, we've definitely done quite a few games already. Okay, since you've been open, well, give me a funny story or a wow story you've seen players do while watching them on the camera. Yeah, so 
Uh, the funny one, the, the best story that I have was we had a family doing our cartel crackdown and they were down to their last minutes. And one of our final games uh, incorporates a lock, which is similar where you have to turn and left and right. So we had someone absolutely with the luck of the world just turn left and right, left and right, and just spin it and it landed exactly where it needed to be. Wow. And it unlocked with three seconds left on the clock. Oh man, that guy needs to go <laughs> right across the street to Caesar. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Put a point in his slot. Because <laughs> that, that is definitely luck. When it happened, all the game masters, we were just astonished. Um, but uh, it was a great experience to have. Yeah, wow, okay, well kudos to him. Yeah. Um, so, um, I know you just opened. Is there any uh, updates or news that's happening in the near... Oh. <laughs> I'm leaving that here. <laughs> Is there any updates that you can share with us about this location in the near future? So yeah, so we currently just opened and of course we opened with four rooms, but um, our owner, Daniel, has uh, you know big plans for us. We're looking to expand possibly to another three rooms. Uh -huh. We do have another one that's currently in construction, which is our one night in Tortuga. That will be our next opening room. Um, so hopefully this time next year, we will have either another additional two games to three games. And we're looking to be the biggest escape room in North America. Wow, so for this location, the max you can have is seven rooms? Um, so we're looking at possibly eight um, with, and of course, depending on how everything goes, we can always expand. Yeah, okay. Well, <laughs> they, yeah, you guys have a lot of games. I think yeah. We're, we're heading over to Vegas and I think we were looking at the list. We're like, wow, we haven't played some of these also. Like, yeah. <laughs> um, do you get a chance to play escape rooms or do you play escape rooms? I do, okay. I do. Um, so I actually started, my first escape room was the panic room in uh, Woodbury in Florida. Oh. Um, so uh, we did one of their rooms there. Um, and we actually, as a group here as Game Masters, we want to continue to enjoy fun and do escape rooms and, and, and spread the word. Oh, yeah. And we even did an escape room here in our another escape room in Tropicana, which is called AC Escape. Which um, game did you play there? Uh, I believe we did the, the uh, Casino Escape. Okay. Uh, with, the, with the double room with the bar. Yes. Um, so it was, uh, we had a blast, of course. Um, very, very difficult. It was their most difficult room that we had. Oh, you mean Casino Cage? Yes. Right? Okay. Yes. Yeah. Um, okay. So um, what was funny is we were in there, we were immersed. Uh, we had 15 minutes left when we thought that we had escaped when we opened the second door and we see an additional six locks. It was insane, but we had a blast and we definitely want to give them a shout out for that. Yeah, shout out to Escape AC. Um, and then can you give us, I guess, maybe another location and a game that was memorable for you? It doesn't have to be, you know, your favorite, mm -hmm. preferably not Panic, because we know Panic has of so course. many rooms. Just one that you played and that stood out for um, I mean, I, definitely the AC Escape was one that, that was very immersive uh, and you really had to work as a team. I mm -hmm. think that was one of the better ones that we had. Um, but I mean, I would have to kind of name one of our own rooms that really kind of just blew my mind. Even though it was one of the smaller rooms in Boston, okay, um, it was it was the Red Wire room. Uh, when I went to Boston and did that room, I did love the the immersiveness and the kind of different technology that they pointed in the last room in that room. Uh, really blew my mind. Um, but other literally, than, yeah, literally, <laughs> almost. <laughs> um, but no, I. Uh, I, I enjoy escape rooms. I definitely want to do uh, an additional um, escape room hopefully soon. Um, but uh, we're pretty busy here, so yeah. I'm trying to keep well, busy. Well, we always here. say it's always important to see what's out there exactly. and play as much as possible. Definitely. You know, even if you're in the industry, whether yes. you're a player or owner or a manager. So, yeah, great. Yeah. Um, the last thing we want to know is more about you, something that uh, you do outside of Panic Room, a talent, a hobby, a special interest, anything that you want to share. Well, of course, uh, you know, I've always grew up with games, Nintendo, things like that. So um, for a long time now, um, eSports has been uh, big in, in, in my life. Okay. Uh, we, we, I've done tournaments. Um, I have my own team, corresponding with Call of Duty. Um, and um, I love anything also dealing with racing. So um, okay. one thing that you guys definitely should check out here in Atlantic City as well is the Lucky 7. They just opened an indoor go-kart um, oh, circuit. So yeah. that's something definitely that's a lot of fun to do. Um, so yeah, that's something that I enjoy. Well, hey, thank you so much for sharing that information and for having us. Oh, really it's a pleasure, it. you guys.
You guys, make sure you like and subscribe our YouTube channel down here below. Click and, uh, and uh, you'll know what to expect when you get over here to Panic Room, Atlantic City. Um, just to reiterate, there is a parking garage across the street and parking in the outlet section of this mall. And then uh, also check out our website, escapetherumors.com, so you'll know what we thought of the two games we're about to play, which is Medieval Madness and Zombie Breakout. Uh, outbreak. Uh. And Zombie <laughs> Outbreak. And uh, hopefully with Elvin's permission, we'll give you a sneak peek inside of each room. Definitely. I'll see what I can do. Peace out.